All right, what's up YouTube? James here with the Buscemi Family Channel. Just got a package that I've been waiting for. This is the Jura Milk Cooler that's going to accompany my Jura E8. The video that I did with this machine and put on YouTube is perhaps the most popular video on my entire channel. For so long, I've gotten accompaniment after accompaniment for my milk cooler. However, you always have to take it and put it in the refrigerator. As you can see here, I have milk here. I have milk here. All of this is for my jerk. But now I'm not gonna have to do that anymore because I got the Jura milk cooler. I'm gonna bring it all to you. Check it out. All right, so let's do the unboxing. All right, guys, so as you can see, I got white. If you watch my Christmas video that I just posted, I originally got black and my wife made the comment, well, black doesn't go with our white Jira. So we went ahead and got the white. I got the white off of Amazon. I'll post the link in the description. It was like 10% off and my link might have a little money off as well. So it wasn't terribly expensive in my opinion. It was, you know, in the range of 200 or something dollars. Uh, but you have to imagine, you're gonna get a lot of use out of this, a tremendous amount of use because you're using this every single day. And the beauty of this is that it stays on the counter, it plugs into a plug, and you're not constantly having to move the milk in and out of the fridge. Let's continue to unbox. All right, guys, everything is unboxed and here's all of the accompaniments of the machine. First and foremost, what you have here is what's called your cool control container. What goes into the cool con control container is the stainless steel container with silicone ring. You can see this silicone ring is right here. On top of that, you have the cover. This cover will eventually go on top here. You have what they call a metal tube. This metal tube will fit into what they call here, the connector. And I'll show you how it all works momentarily here. They give you a couple of connectors here. I'm, I'm assuming they give you more than one in case one breaks down. So you do have extras. You have two, what we call milk pipes, according to the directions, milk pipes. And again, I think they give you one extra, obviously. You have the plug, self-explanatory. You have what they call the fridge cover. Lastly, you have your directions, which comes in multiple languages, as well as a guarantee. I'm gonna figure out how to work it all, and I'm going to come back to you in a moment and put it all together so that you see exactly how it works. All right, guys, the first thing is pretty self-explanatory. How do you plug the machine in? Obviously, here's the plug. This female part is going to go into the male part on the back of the machine. As you can see here, there it is. You're just gonna go ahead and plug that in. Okay, guys, next, what we're gonna do is we're going to attach the metal tube to the connector. Just so you're aware, this metal tube is what sits inside of the milk cooler and draws the milk from the milk cooler. So the way that we do that, pretty simple stuff. Take a look. You're gonna take the connector, simply turn it like that, take the metal tube, stick it right in just like that, and you're done with that particular piece. Next, you're gonna take one of these connectors, it comes with two, and you're gonna put it in this connector here. And what's gonna happen here is the milk tube, which is one of these, is gonna go from here to your machine 
right here. So let's connect it now. And there you have it, completely connected. So after you've connected the metal piece to the connector and this little connector here, it's time to take your milk tube and connect it. Very simple stuff. Once that's done, you've gotten your contraption completely set up. It's time to put it into the metal container. This is the metal container. You're simply gonna place this with the metal tube going into the container and this tube coming out. Remember, this is the tube that's gonna go to your coffee maker. So now, let's put this metal container into the machine. Essentially, this metal container is gonna hold the milk, it's gonna house the milk, and this is what the machine is gonna cool and, and allow it to stay on your countertop. So take a look here. And you're gonna place that right in, but come over here, let me show you. If you look down in here, you'll see there's little nodules here. This is going to sit right inside those little nodules. And that's how you know that you have it in correct. I'm gonna put this right here so it looks good. I'm gonna take my milk tube, plug it right to the machine. I'm gonna take my plug, and I'm gonna plug it back here so it's nice and hidden. I'm gonna hit the power button, and you can actually hear the machine going on. Now, I'm gonna add some milk. the cover on and that's it I'm all set all right guys another really cool thing that I just figured out with the milk cooler is that it tells you when the milk is starting to get low check this out you could see here on camera it looks like this is blinking but what this is saying is that with all three lit up that it's filled it's filled to the top as this goes down or there's one less light on, what it's telling you is that there's less milk. So when you get down to one line, you know that it might be time to kind of clean it out and you know get more milk in the machine. All right guys, it's time to make a cup of coffee with my new milk cooler. Cappuccino, boom. guys so that's the jura milk cooler white oliva link in the description